Yep. Ready? Uh, three, two. How'd the uh, golf experience go? Well, it was a great experience. Uh, had a couple of big numbers early, and uh, got me behind the eight ball. The kid I was playing with birdied the first three holes, and so uh, I'm standing on the six tee, five shots back, knowing that uh, it's not turning out as planned. But, uh, man, it was great. It was a lot of fun. It was fun to see him play, shoot 65, and uh, um, I'll be much better next year just with the experience. So this was to get into the U.S. Open, right? Well, yeah, it was to get to the second round. And then the guys that are playing uh, actually Monday and Tuesday, um, you know, the top finishers there, two or three spots at each each place uh, getting to the U.S. Open. So, um, you know, you're you're basically three good rounds away from uh, from playing in the U.S. Open. You're a pressure guy, uh, 2007 Soldier Field overtime, NFC um, uh, final game of the season, beating the Giants, winning the division a couple of years ago, and this was a pressure tournament. It, uh, your thoughts? Well, you know, funny thing, I talked to, uh, you know, Murph, our special teams coach, right afterwards, and I said I was standing on the, uh, on the first green, and I had uh, hit a chip shot, I'd missed the green, hit a chip shot to about six feet. And I was standing there reading the putt, and I was thinking, oh, my gosh, this is exactly like, you know, Sundays in, in the fall. And uh, there's nothing you can do to get uh, in that situation except to be in that situation, you know. And, and uh, I ended up making the putt, but uh, I definitely had a flashback there to uh, this is pressure. And the difference is when I'm lining up with my right leg, I generally know it's going to fly straight. But when I got a uh, driver or putter in my hand, it's, uh, it's a little squirrely. So 99 out of 100 people you play in just your regular walk of life, you're either going to win or be extremely competitive with what you're telling me here is in this qualifier it's it's a a different level of pressure that that many probably never will feel yeah totally different and you know to be honest with you my rounds the first you know like the three weeks beforehand were all in the high 60s i mean I, i was playing well going in um the difference is, is after talking to some of my, my friends that are on the tour uh, down there, um, there's a difference between hitting the golf ball and playing golf. And the, the guys that are going for the U.S. Open know how to play golf, and the tour guys know how to play. And so that's what I got to transition to is rather than just going out and, you know, beating the guy I'm playing with normally during the year um, to actually tournament golf and how to play the game and strategy-wise and, and uh, um, you know, get better at that part of it. Final question, organized team activities, how are you hitting it out here? Uh, good, you know. I've, uh, I've kicked twice and uh, hit him well, and uh, you know it's one of those things where you're 14. Hard to believe it's uh, gone this long, and sure. and uh, you still feel like you can do it for a lot of years. So you just try to uh, keep him flying straight. Thank you. My pleasure, Ryan Longwell. See you.